35 definitely looks good on me. As I am 35 now and it's a milestone year, I kind of had a little bit of reservation of going into this year, but I definitely am embracing her and she and who I am becoming always and always. Today I've teamed up with my first wig to bring you this gorgeous, gorgeous curtain bang lace wig. I'm going to install her 100% glueless and as you guys can see, she definitely accentuates the 35 year old me. She's getting grown, sexy, classy, but definitely a party all the way around. If you're interested to seeing how we got this look let's get started okay love bugs let's jump right into it as always they included the pink portable wig stand which always comes in handy this is the box as well as the packaging inside you do get this pink dust bag which you're supposed to keep forever and it's also some great goodies inside which i'll show towards the end of the video here i am pulling the wig out and unveiling her for the first time this is our gorgeous gorgeous girl right here we are going with curtain bangs today and i'm super excited about that this here is a 13 by 6 glueless lace front wig she's 20 inches in length silky straight texture she does include the adjustable elastic band which does say my first wig on it she's a 100% virgin Indian hair, 130% density, and I can go on and on about the accolades, but this is what she looks like on. We have invisible lace, pre pluck hairline, light bleached knots, adjustable strap, and elastic added. So here is a look at the hairline. It definitely is giving a natural vibe without doing anything at all. So you'll definitely be able to pin this one back and give bomb flawless hairline as well. But for now, let's go ahead and jump right into the install process. I did go ahead and cut off a little bit of the lace just above the eyebrows. And then I also cut off all of the excess lace around the ears. Now we already know this is a key step. You cannot keep your wig covering your ears at all. So we cover to make sure that it's snatched. Also, I'm giving you another look at the hairline. I just was amazed because this one is a curtain bang, which is not technically styled to show off the hairline. And they still executed the hairline so effortlessly. I am blown away. So since there was nothing I needed to do as far as customization goes, I went ahead and cut off the remainder of the lace. And I'm just using a pair of shears. Got these from Amazon. It's time to replace them because I've had them for years. And they're not as sharp as they once were. Today we're going Maybelline Fit Me for my lace tint products. I'm going to take a little bit of that liquid foundation. And I'm just going to go in generously along the hairline. I want it to melt into my hairline as best as possible so just adding something that is liquid is going to help to you know make sure everything matches with my skin flawlessly and I am showing you guys that this is the install and that's it we're not gluing or bonding anything down at all I did go on top of that foundation with a little bit of powder to set it and then here I am just combing the hair out with a rat tail comb I really do love the texture on this hair she's absolutely gorgeous so we're going to go ahead and extend the parting. I believe this one is six inches of parting space going back. So in theory, once you buy the wig, obviously it's yours. You can definitely part her in all different ways. Of course, I'm going to go with the simple buzz down middle part to accentuate the curtain bang today. But again, you'll be able to switch it up if you're bored and go back and forth. You can even do like half up, half down, braids, twisties in the front. Whatever you like, you can do. So for styling purposes, we are doing the dynamic duo. We've added a generous amount of the wax along the parting space and we're just going in and smoothing it out. Now this is a step you can definitely skip if you want to keep the volume up top. I'm also going to take that same foundation powder we've used along the hairline and just apply it at the parting space. I want to give a snatched hairline, blends with skin, flawless, all of the above and these two products definitely work very well. Now we are pulling out our big barrel. This one is from Hot Tools and of course I have it in the description box. This one is handy. You can get it from Target. This one already came with some beautiful curls but I did go in and just add a few curls on the top. Now I definitely can't take credit. I definitely got this set from my mom. Back in the day like when it was time to get ready for work she obviously used to wear her hair like in her natural you know her natural hair she didn't wear like wigs and weaves and so like when it came to adding volume to her hair after it's gotten a few days old she would go in and just add curls to literally that top layer and that would give her her body like she would add the curls and let them just stay in place until she got to work and then she would use her fingers to kind of like pull them apart and that would take away some of the flatness and give her hair a lot of body and that's basically what I'm doing today because I didn't think it needed too much curling since it was already curled 
Then I added a little bit of Flex Hold Hairspray just to keep it in place as much as possible. And also I'm going to do like my mom did and I'm just going to use my fingers and try not to use a brush or a comb at first. And I love the definition on this one. I love the curtain banks on this one. I'm just kind of like shaking my head back and forth because again I want to keep the body and I want to keep the curls. I want to keep everything dramatic but I also want to give like the perfect bangs the perfect curtain bangs up front I think I did a great job and then my bed today is just plain old meal a bottle of water with a couple squirts of the red meal in it I love this stuff and it helps me to become a little bit more hydrated and drink my water a lot more fast now I'm showing you guys the packaging. This one did come with some goodies inside of the dust bag. You got your wig caps as well as the info card. And then inside the box, you got these two packs of deep conditioner as well as the flyaway tamer, which is awesome. You also got this little mini magazine, which is super cute. I think that was like Andrea Larasia, Larasia Andrea here on YouTube. And then it also came with this reusable pouch. I love it. And it came with alligator clips as well as this rat tail comb. Absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous with a great great packaging to go with it and this is the final look guys i'm so happy and pleased with the way this one came out be sure to check this one out in the description box you know there's a direct link there this one comes from lengths 12 inch to 20 inch and you can definitely customize to your liking when it comes to all of the details thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe and as always i'll see you in the next one smooches